the talk. Welcome. It's the Easter edition. Hey, happy Easter, check this guy. Happy Easter, this guy too. Hey, and that guy. Hey, and it's snowing, 2018, Easter. Yeah. It's snowing. Hey, welcome, we're back at the talk studios and since it is snowing, I'm indoors. We gotta do some very important research. Uh, because it's snowing outside, uh, so I got some good documentaries for wintertime stuff. So, you know, important documentaries like, I don't know, Cat Beefy, or you know, some very important documentaries on penguins like Surf's Up. How many anime features can you make on penguins? Anyway, apparently a lot. I'm getting ready for the snow coming in. We're gonna get one to four inches. And I had to think, if I'm gonna do some important reading and some research. So if I'm gonna be doing some indoor activity and some reading and things like that. It's good to have some special light to read by. So I want to thank uh, someone named Courtney who provided me a lamp. It's a homemade lamp. Oh, you want to see the rest of it? Yeah, that'd be a good idea. It's a homemade lamp out of a giant Jack Daniels bottle. Yes, it really is, or was, a Jack Daniels bottle turned into a working lamp. So now I have something to read by. Thanks, Courtney. So for this uh, Easter topic, we'll make it short and sweet. This word Easter, where the heck did it come from? We call it Easter, but what did it come from? And we know what it represents because it, the Christians say it represents the time in which Jesus Christ rose from the dead. But the word Easter, where did it come from? It goes way back to an English monk named Bede, B-E-D-E. -E. Uh, there was actually a goddess named Easter. It's E-O-S-T-R-E. -E. I'll put it up here where my finger is and post edit. Right now I'm just pointing in the air, but there should be some words up there. <laughs> you see the video. But uh, Yister. And they had this time period where they recognized this Yister, and it was called Yister Mana. And that was the time period. Coincidentally, it was the exact same time that the Christians already were celebrating when Jesus Christ rose from the dead. There just wasn't a name for it at the time. And they picked up this name from that. So your stir started evolving and over time became Esther and then finally Easter. So this word Easter, according to educational people that study uh, Bibles and spirituality and things like that, came from this uh, Christian, well, not Christian, the goddess named Easter. There you go. Have a good Easter. Hope it was good. Hope we didn't eat too much. Enjoy. Come on back. Always like seeing you one more time.